Is there any math involved? Yeah, no. totally. Uh, there's like math questions in there? Mm -hmm. I'm done then. <laughs> <laughs> Hello everyone, as you may have guessed, it is yet another episode of Rapid Brown with CBC Sports. My name is Jacqueline Dory and today we are going to get to know Canadian swimmer Santo Condorelli. Are you ready? I guess so, we'll see. You said something <laughs> to the effect that your body is fast, but... My mind can be a little slow at times. <laughs> I'm sure you're gonna prove yourself wrong. Too. All right. So, so if you were not a swimmer, what would you be? Race car driver. It'd be fun. Favorite? Formula One? Sorry. No, no, I'm sorry. Your least favorite part about swimming is? Training. Your favorite part about swimming is? Racing. The dirty truth about swimming that only a swimmer would know. You have to shave everything? There you go. I had no idea. Uh, Which would you rather go <laughs> with those? Swimming or toothpaste? Swimming. Most you, you said swimming and toothpaste. Yeah, which would you rather go without? Yeah, yeah, swim. I'll take toothpaste. I can't like... Good breath over Yeah, swimming. exactly. It'd be kind of dirty, ew. In the pool, Speedo or Trunks? Speedo. At the beach, Speedo or Trunks? Speedo. Which do you prefer, freestyle or butterfly? Freestyle. Why? Because I'm faster. <laughs> do you have a nickname? Um, My father calls me Golden Boy. Why is that? I don't know. He just likes calling me it. I'll go with it. What song would we be most surprised to find on your iPod? Probably Justin Bieber's Christmas album. It's pretty solid, not gonna lie. Most embarrassing moment ever at the pool? Probably missing my race. Mm. Uh, um, I was like at a Grand Prix. I was like taking a shower. I was just, like hanging out. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> if you could have lunch with anybody, dead or alive, who would it be and why? Uh, Albert Einstein. Why? Why not? He's the smartest man in the world. Touche, there you go. And that's your rapid round. Thank you for watching.